people as one of the best graphics demos that I've seen of the ZX Spectrum uh, when it came out. It was a 199 title. And uh, let's let's just uh, switch over straight to the uh, uh, to the Spectrum uh, and get everything up and running because I just want to show you how good uh, the opening uh, on Pippo is. So uh, to do that, we're going to need to come back to our Spectrum uh, and bring in the tape file. Okay, so obviously we have the loading screen and you can tell when it's loaded because it all starts flashing. So it puts in a sound a bit like a loading sound at the very end, just to catch you off guard. Uh, and then you've got something that just looks like it's right of colour. It's actually just the flash attribute. Uh, uh, so you're know, cunning use of graphics and colours throughout here to get flash going on as well. Of course it's using mobile flashes because you see for example that tongue. If you watch the tongue on Pippo, um, it's, there's a red, there's a green and there's a blue in there. So there is some attribute swapping going on but it's just on the colour layer of the pixel so it's not doing a lot of switching. Uh, so now you, you can't really see here but if you can see where the border is, if we just go into here, uh, it, look at that, look at that. Uh, that is a big sprite spinning around being calculated on the fly it does nothing for the game it, it, it but it does make you feel comfortable and welcome it's great big effect to come in uh, and you've got one of the most welcoming menu screens as well you've got animation running through it you've got uh, music driven interrupts so we're going to be on the chemistry uh, for it, this one uh, and now we're going to get something that I rarely see which is a full screen number which is it uses the border as well to do three, two, one. You can just catch it at the edges um, of the screen. So watch for this one here. Three, two, taken right to the edge of the spectrum frame. Now, seriously, you look at that on a TV, and you're used to just the window in the middle of a spectrum, and that comes up. Wow. Back to that menu introduction, level one, and we are finally into the game. And thankfully... The game itself is pretty rewarding uh, as well. You are Pippo! All you gotta do is just change all the tiles to the colour that you're asked to. You've got to avoid the bad guys, which in this case is Smiler. You've got a power pill, so it's a bit like Pac-Man. You get the occasional extra life coming up from Tenerino, Tiny Me, uh, and a UFO which moves incredibly quickly. And that is one of the simplest arcade games you can get. The only other thing that really does help Pippo in the world is this sound effect where you jump off the edge of the playing area. Full screen graphics, sprites, arcade action, synthesized voice, this. This was just wonderful. And you know what? It still is.